What is up guys? It's Jexter back again. So today we got another little video for you. It's going to be an awesome little video. I'm not going to tell you what it is just yet. I just wanted to talk to you for a second. So, uh, before we get started, I want to clear something up because a lot of people have this misconception. This hat is not for Green Bay. Okay? That is a G for Georgia Bulldogs. You can see the red. Yes, this hat is one of my favorite hats. Okay? This hat right here is the Georgia Bulldogs hat. I just got it last year. It's freaking amazing. All right, got it from Lids. If you don't know what that is, amazing store. Check it out. What I do like about this hat is it has my name engraved on the side of it. So, yeah, I just gave you a little sneak peek at who Jegster really is. Now you got part of my name. Huh. So, let's get started into this video. All right, so this video today, we're going to be doing the reaction to the new Captain Marvel trailer. Before we get started, I have to be honest with some things before, so I don't look stupid in the trailer because it's going to happen either way, but I'd rather it happen less likely, you know, if I go ahead and just go ahead and spill my guts real quick. So, I am a super, super fan of DC and Marvel. All superhero kind of stuff. I watch a lot of anime. I mean, I'm big on Dragon Ball Z, if you don't know by now from my last video. Uh, I check out lots of anime. I love action. You know, I love all that kind of stuff. Okay, so... Probably my favorite uh, superhero from Marvel, since we are going to be watching the Captain Marvel trailer. Let's go and get that out there. My first, my, not my first, my, well, I'd say my favorite all time. My favorite all time superhero from Marvel has got to be uh, Deadpool. <laughs> Deadpool, which you got my hat over there, you guys will see in other videos. Deadpool is a dude, but then again, you can't put him in the same aspect as everybody else because his movies are always R-rated, so, you know, let's take it down, let's take Deadpool out for a minute, and let's just say we got to the point where all audiences can watch it, out of characters that all audiences are familiar with, you know, that are familiar with Marvel. Let's say, this is actually a very hard one, I have several that I really, really like. And it, uh, at DC, it would be a lot easier. You know, I could, boom, name it off real quick. But uh, for Marvel, I'd have to say it had to be my main man, Spider-Man, right here. Now, this dude is amazing. I mean, if you're going to talk about Deadpool, you might as well put Spider-Man. He's, he's basically the PG version of Deadpool. Got the, the, the smart quips. You know, he's got the smart Alec mouth. He's a young kid. It's He's freaking awesome. I love Spider-Man. Overall, I like his powers, too. He has amazing abilities, and I do believe that if you really think about it, he has the abilities to take on most people from the Marvel Universe in, uh, in a certain light, you know, a certain aspect, depending on what the actual battle, you know, qualifications are or whatever. But overall, I think he's very dope. Okay, so... If, you want to go in like second and third? I would say it's a hard between the Hulk and Wolverine. Now, the reason why I like both of them, I mean, I mean, we gotta say, you know, they're both bad A, like super awesome. They ain't nobody messing with either one of them. Okay, so the Wolverine part. The reason why I like Wolverine is because he's always been raw. He's been ruthless. You know, he's had anger issues, and I mean, you guys are gonna catch that familiar trend with me. Uh, through a lot of my characters and different shows, you know, Logan, Wolverine, he's had a lot of anger, but he's always out there on his own surviving, you know, which is, is something that I've always thought was very interesting. I love people that can do that. Plus, you know, he's his own man. He's, he's doing his own thing. He's got his own ambitions and stuff, and he's just raw cut. The Hulk, it's definitely because anger, because, I mean, Bruce, I can't really relate to Bruce Banner. Okay? I'm not really, I am pretty smart, but I'm not like that kind of smart, you know, so. It's the Hulk, man. The Hulk just, I don't know, he gets your adrenaline pumping, man. You just know, the more anger you make this dude, the worse he's going to be for you. The harder he's going to fight. He's bound to almost limitless, honestly, by power. You know, he, you just piss him off more and more, and he's going to come at you more and more and more. <clears throat> so that's all for, like, my, my Marvel characters. But what we're diving into today is Captain Marvel. I'm kind of ashamed to admit this, you know, as much as I know about the comics and the shows and how far I've been traveling back with them, following them, I can honestly say I don't really know anything about Captain Marvel. I, I just, I really don't know anything about her. I mean, I'm doing a little studying up now because the movie is going to be coming out soon and I really want to know something about her before 
And there's so many rumors of when she's going to come in. Possibly even at the end of the second Avengers movie, people were thinking that she's going to come in and kind of whoop up on Thanos. But I don't know. We're going to see what happens there. I am sad to admit that I really don't know much about her. So watching this trailer, I, I'm hoping I'll learn a little more about what she is. I really don't even know what her powers are exactly. You know, I don't even know uh, really her, her history or anything. So this is going to be fresh, new to me. And, I, you know, of course, I've definitely never seen her in live action before. So we're going to go ahead and get right started into this. Uh, I think that it's going to be surprising for both of us, all of you guys and me. All right, so we got the video put up right here. And let's go ahead and start in three, two, one, go. And yes, I got to give myself a countdown so I can line my videos up. I'm new at this. I'm new. All right. So is that her? War is a universal language. I know a renegade soldier when I see one. Never occurred to me that one might come from above. I love how they always put the comics in there in this show too. It's so cool. Space invasion. So she's an alien. Truth be told, I was ready to hang She can up. shoot lasers. Is that it is He's in this one, obviously, you know, he's you know the main one that's gonna bring them all together, but still, it makes sense. Kind of confusing. So, like, what is her ability? She she got electric, super strength, or something? We have no idea what threats are out there. Whoa! She just stalked an old woman in the face. Look at that mask. Those things are dope. Look, that's that reminds me of Batman. Yeah. Whoa, now that costume though, that looks that looks pretty sick. Okay, so what? I, I don't even know. Wow. Pretty intense actually. Pretty intense. So guys, uh honestly I don't know what to think yet about her. I mean from seeing what I saw I assumed that uh one one second. Alright, so, from what I saw, she looks pretty beast. I mean, like, pretty strong. She's got the suit that looks amazing, but what is the electric power? I, I'm kind of calling for you guys to uh, come out and, like, help me out with this situation and, like, maybe give me some stuff in the comments and let me know what I need to know about Captain Marvel. You know, what's her main abilities? I mean, what I've heard that she is a similar version to Marvel Superman. You know, basically, she's Marvel's Superman, kind of. So I don't really know exactly what that means. She's obviously alien. She's got a bunch of abilities. Uh, her suit looks pretty dope. But uh, I don't really know much about her. And even from the trailer, I didn't really get an aspect. I mean, it seemed like she had done some whatever she was doing in life several times. I mean, or like it just showed her kept falling and I was trying to understand what that was about. You know, I when I, I got a vibe of like the Supergirl vibe when I saw her. I... I got the vibe of like, you know, her not getting hurt and stuff when she was younger, but taking injuries and, and figuring out what's going on. But even though Supergirl kind of knew who she was before, or she knew she was an alien at least, seems like she has no recollection of who she is. You know, she says she has memories, so she could be from a far off planet. I, I'm not sure, but not, I'm pretty sure that if you guys are searching for this video, then you know more than I do. So just what I want you to do is just drop down in the comments. Maybe just a little fact about Captain Marvel. Just let me know a little bit what you guys think about this movie that's going to come up. Is it going to, you know, hold up to what your expectations are for for Captain Marvel? Because, like, like I said, I'm very familiar with the comics, 
and the Marvel Universe is not as much as the DC. Now the DC Universe, I'm on my stuff. I love the DC, but Marvel, I'm I'm, I'm pretty much caught up on most of it. There's lots of pieces though I missed though over the years, you know. And Captain Marvel was one of them, and so I don't even know anything really. So if you guys can help me out, drop it down in the comments. Let me know any facts about her. Let me know what your uh, opinions are for this trailer and what you expect from the movie if you think it's really going to come up to your expectations. Besides that, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to, let, let me see if I can do this right. Like, subscribe, and hit that bell notification so you can get notified of when I'm coming out of the next video. Yeah, and that's it guys, this is Jekster. So if you have any questions for me, any request for me, any random notations of information that you want me to know, just drop it down in the comments. Drop it all down in the comments. Hate mail, positive mail, all of it. I just want to see what you guys got, what you guys can bring to me. So yeah, if you enjoyed it, you know what to do. And I'll catch you guys on the next video. So I am out. Peace.